So, uh, what learning can be shared yep. regarding the old team's skill yep. set yep. not up to the speed? Yep. Um, the, the, the way it is put is that post training, if they still do not come up to the spec, yep. do you let them go with dignity? Yep. I, I personally, um, so I think, so most of my work is in a development space. It's people making development steps to be better at work than they were the day before. So I believe that everyone needs to be given the opportunity to take those steps. But if they're not capable to take that step, then it's not appropriate to demand that and if they don't want to. So as I said, give everybody a ticket on the bus, but provide the necessary training, but it needs to be real, okay? And if people don't do what the training is encouraging, they need to be challenged and questioned about why, okay? And it needs to be constructive and positive because um, there'll always be one or two who resist, okay? But you need to manage to the eight or nine who don't. My experience will be that the one or two who resist, who have the ticket but don't want it, they'll go somewhere else. You may ask them to go somewhere else as well. I think you've got every right to do that if you've been clear about the strategic direction. You've given them the opportunity to grow and learn and develop, but if they're choosing not to, then there needs to be a consequence to people's behaviour.